Today's two big positive surprises were car sales and Blue Scope Steel. Now, the used car market is booming, so car sales profit surged 23%, while Australia's biggest steelmaker, Blue Scope, more than doubled its profit to $2.8 billion, although that was mainly due to a near tripling of profit at its steel mill in Ohio in the United States. Today's other big news was that Nearmap, the company that provides accurate aerial photos, has had a billion dollar nibble from a big global private equity firm. Now the bidder is talking $2.10 a share, so I'm not sure why punters have only taken the price to $1.90. Meanwhile, Beach Energy and Bendigo and Adelaide Bank disappointed investors with their results today. The US market had a solid rise on Friday, but Asian markets were up and down today. On commodity markets, iron ore, oil and base metals all fell, while gold went up and the Australian dollar has slipped back to below 71 US cents. And by the way, if you're wondering why airports are a mess at the moment, here are some graphs that might help. Paid passenger kilometres being flown by the airlines is back to what it was before the pandemic. And jobs in accommodation are back to pre-pandemic levels as well. But employment in air transport is still 31% below what it was. Hardly a surprise that there are queues. And that's finance. Thanks for watching. You can check out more finance news by clicking there and don't forget to click subscribe down there to get all the latest updates from ABC News.